Hi everybody from Fallout 4. I'm looking at the Slog Diner Player Home today. It's yet another mod by Red Rocket TV and I have fast become a firm fan of his. My god, honestly, the work he does is amazing. This one, we're just outside the Slog and I'm feeling a bit guilty because I've done literally nothing with this settlement yet. No defences, nothing. It's in its entire naked state and... Ah, oh, man, how do you find the time? You... you to just do them all it's impossible anyhow um so this place as you can see it's a diner or was it's now your player home it's amazing you have to unlock um this settlement the slog first and then you can have it there's so many features i've got my exterior and interior lights on you can turn them on or off as you wish there's a dog house out here power armor and things to take all over the place inside and out oh man there are never enough gears or screws in the world just not enough and for some reason i've got this random door it doesn't do anything it's just there i you may not have it on yours it could well be a load order issue for me my load order is already groaning under the weight of the mods that i've got um, it's not even funny so yeah outside amazing you can sit any side at all that you want and look at the devastation wow I really like this place it's super cute all right inside it's even better it's amazing So many interactive features. A lot of them are the same. They're repeated across his homes. So customized weapons and armor benches. There is storage everywhere. So, you know, keep your eyes open because you'll find something to surprise you. It's a chem station, a barber chair. These magnificent skylights kitchen oh my god it really looks like a diner's kitchen doesn't it there is a cooking stove so you can cook and you can drink from the sink if you so wish this is where i do my ablutions as well by the way there's no separate bathroom for this one there's a safe down there hobby pins your nuka cola shelf love that feature The music system. Very cool. Love it. Food shelf. The fridge, by the way, um, it also has that. If you put um, your drinks in there, I think it's Nuka Cola, Vim, and something else, uh, then you'll get the cold, ice cold buff. And then through here, you've got your little place for dog meat. Some lockers and mannequins. And you can open and close the skylight. Wow. Quite noisy, isn't it? And it's super bright when you open it up. Oh my god. <laughs> it kind of makes you feel almost as though you're in a bunker, but not quite. So, bobblehead shelf. And here's something new that I hadn't noticed before. I've picked up a couple of these little mini robot things as I've been around and about in the world. And here's a shelf where you can display them all. Wow, I love that. All homes should have one, that's so nifty. And even more nifty. Check out my bed. And it knows my name. So this is brilliant, don't you think? This is like a, a stopover type of mod. Um, there's a My First Infirmary tucked away down there. Storage, um, you can do either by the terminal, which is over here, or as you come in the door, I walk straight past it, sorry. There's a, a chest that you can sort there. Oh, the TV's out of order. Look at all this artwork and everything. It's just so in keeping so clever 
really feeling it, you know? So at your terminal, you can sort out your inventory. There's the information that tells you about the fridge. There's a trash compactor also. I'll show you where that is in a second. And you can display your mannequins um, either as male or female. Brilliant. Uh, you can unlock the safe. I already picked it, but you can. Settings, you can control your interior and exterior lights also. Oh, it's, it's amazing. All mod cons. Uh, so yeah, the trash compactor is actually hiding down here. That's what this thing is. Uh, so you can recycle your junk. What a terrific little home this is. I am so impressed. I've got a few more of his to see. So I'll bring those to you anon. Um, you know, just as and when I get to them. Many of you have mentioned this guy to me and I'm so glad you did because his mods are just my, right up my street. You know, they make me happy. So I will leave it here, call that the end of this wee video and I will see you soon for the next one. Take care and stay safe everyone.